I'm gonna be super honest with you guys, this new Charizard card looks like shit. I'm gonna say it outright, I'm gonna offend some people, but I feel like the community as a whole has a very good take that this card looks like one of those fake cards that you see a literal seven-year-old trying to trade you for your alternate art at the playground. Also, what are you doing at a playground, you adult male? Get, get out of there, Chris Hansen, I'm gonna give him a call. But you get the point. Basically what I'm saying is, this gold Charizard hyper rare, or you are, whatever they want to fucking call it now, uh, coming out of the new Obsidian Flames or whatever the fuck the set's called, it looks like shit, man. It looks like dog shit. And I'm all for the Terra Full Art cards. I think they are fantastic. I, th I think they're beautiful. I love the Arcanine. I love the Gyarados. I love the Slow King. I just purchased a pristine 10 one and a PSA 10 one because I really like them and my girlfriend loves them. However... The Terra fucking Fortress, I could do without. Uh, but this one is somehow worse. I just, I don't know, man. Like, I'm sure that this Charizard in the norma, normal Terra full art probably looks good. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Kind of looks weird. I don't know. However, this gold version of it looks like absolute shit. It looks terrible. It, it's, it's bad. It's just bad. And, man, it's like... It literally looks like a fake card. I, I, I don't know what you guys think. I don't know. You can let me know in the comments if you like it. Uh, but it looks like a fake card. It looks like some fucking knockoff Amazon bullshit. It looks like something that you would actively seek to try and trick people into thinking is a real card. When someone searches up rare Pokemon card, this and other 3,000 other fake gold cards <laughs> come up. A and this is real, apparently. I don't know, man. It's just It looks bad. It's a bad look um, for the direction of the, the hyper rares and URs, the gold cards. Like, I'm seeing this Charizard gold and I'm like, get rid of them. Get rid of them. Stop. Stop now. Stop this shit. Get rid of this. Go back to the drawing board. Think of something better. Because this is not cutting it. This is dog shit. I don't know what you guys think. Uh, let me know in the comments, clearly. Uh, there was also a Charizard EX SAR that was apparently leaked, but the art from that was found to be from like a, a post back in 2018 or something, so that was completely fake. Uh, in case you were curious about that too, that's completely fake. Uh, but the gold one is real, and uh, I don't want to I don't want to harp on it for too long. But if this is the direction they're going to go with the Terra Full Art with like a gold version that just looks gaudy and fake, like it genuinely looks fake. Like, I, I just don't think it's a bad look uh, or I, I don't think it's a good look for the future of gold cards. I feel like they should be fucking obsolete at this point. Make them like rainbow rares. Just get rid of them. Like, I get some people like them. But if this is the dire if you're going to go from like Giratina V-Star from Crown Zenith and V-Star Universe to whatever the fuck this is, maybe, just maybe, we take a step back and analyze where we went where we went wrong. Um, I don't know. You guys let me know in the comments what you think. Clearly, I'm not a huge fan of this gold Charizard card that's apparently coming out in a, either it's Obsidian, the, the Black Flame, Obsidian, Fl Dark Charizard, another Charizard set. I don't know what, it, what it's called. I don't care. Um, I think it's Obsidian Flames or something, but... If this is what's coming out in that set, that la that leaves me worried about the future of gold cards for the very least. Uh, I think the Terra version might be good, but it just looks like he has a spiky hat with a chandelier on his head. Like, it kind of looks like shit. It kind of looks like shit. I don't know, man. You tell me what you guys think. I don't like it. I think it's gaudy. I think it looks like a fake card. I think it sucks. Um, maybe it's because it's bad quality that we're not getting the full in-depth look of the uh the golden charizard <laughs> but it, it looks bad man you, you could have gone a direction like v star universe but you didn't and that sucks to see man it sucks to see that they didn't because uh you know anytime there's a charizard card people lose their shit and i think this might finally be the charizard card that kills all hype surrounding future charizard cards because this one is dog shit i hope 151's charizard sar does it justice because if this is what we're getting right after it, this is, this is bad, man. This is bad. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Anyways, leave a comment what you think down below regarding this Charizard. I don't like it at all. Um, it looks like shit. Looks like, it looks like fucking shit. Anyways, have a good one, lads. And uh, new video tomorrow. Stream tonight. Come on by. Uh, we have the Slab Wheel. It's a high-tier Slab Wheel. All slabs in the, in the high-tier Slab Wheel. 
are over $70, upwards to $200, and all you got to pay is $75 for a spin. It's very easy. It's very profitable for you. I got the slabs at a good price, so I can I can put it at a price where they typically sell. And uh, you know, worst that comes to worst, you lose five bucks on like two of them, and the other eight are profitable. So it's good for you. Um, so if you're interested, come on by. If not, uh, yeah, tell me how much you hate this card. Anyway, see you guys in the next one.